Perth is facing a millipede infestation as the summer turns into autumn. Scientists say there are already billions of the pests across our suburbs and it's only likely to get worse. Jeff Hoddy is facing a creepy crawly invasion. The excretion they ooze smells. It's horrible. And um, yeah, and they, they get into bed with you sometimes as well. You feel them crawling on you sometimes. It's just horrible. It is a losing battle. It, it gets very distressing sometimes. You have people over and they're crawling around on the floor. It makes you feel really horrible. Jeff's just one of thousands of Perth homeowners with a Portuguese millipede problem. He's tried everything to rid his property of the bugs. It's just two nights worth there. And you, you can see by the size of them, there's big ones, small ones, and they, it smells to high heaven. It's been almost 30 years since the species was first discovered in Perth. They came from South Australia. Now there are billions across WA. A single female millipede will lay over 200 eggs, each of them the size of a pinhead. And it's about now, at the start of autumn, that they'll hatch and we see an explosion in the number of these tiny creatures. And they can cause chaos. 18 months ago, the bugs were blamed for a train accident on the Joondalup line. It's believed their bodies made the track so slippery a carriage couldn't stop. Six people were injured. They're completely harmless and sure they're pestiferous, but they have short periods where they're a nuisance. And there's nothing that can be done to control them entirely. But the Department of Agriculture says you can put up a fight by dimming the lights at night time, sealing all cracks under doors, spraying entry points with lubricant and moving leaf litter from beside your house. If you haven't got them, you're lucky. Michael Genovese, Nine News.